How's it going everyone? Lucian Sword here playing some more Brawlhalla for you guys today as always. And it's another year, another October, and that means another Brawlhalloween event. This time we're looking at Brawlhalloween 2020. And actually check it out. They have a ton of past content to, to look at. All these Brawlhalloween skins, plus a couple new ones. We got Werewolf Thatch. It's high moon. <laughs> I actually really like the weapons too. Part of the, one of the biggest like reasons I love buying skins is because you get the weapon skins too, which you can use on other legends. So look at those blasters with the teeth on it. Oh man, that looks so cool. And then we also have a brand new skin for Mirage, Corpse Bride Mirage. Also with really cool looking weapon skins, especially the scythe. I really like that. The spear's not too bad, but not that great looking either. Here comes the bride, all dressed to flight. To fight, sorry. <laughs> so, we're gonna go ahead and purchase it. We're gonna go ahead and purchase that. And, uh, yeah, there's actually a little bit more to look at. I already have all the other past Halloween skins. Like, we got Dusk Till Dawn, Petra Reanimated. We got Skelazuri, Werebat Ragnar, Immortal Caspian, The Monster Nash. We got Pumpkin Spice Yumiko, one of my, actually, probably my favorite Halloween skin. And then we have Demonkin Diana. I love her bow on that one. Horseman Lucian, probably my second favorite. And Bewitching Scarlet. And I think that's it for Halloween skins. But we do also have the KO effect you can get. The Jack-O-Lantern. I think I already have that equipped, actually. Yes, I do. Uh, you can also get the new Graveyard Shift 2020 Podium. Or one of the previous ones. Actually, no, not all the previous ones. I have Toil... Toil and Trouble they show right there, but there's actually more. Uh, I'll show you. I'll show you. Let's go ahead and get this one first. And then let's see if there's anything else. Oh, yeah, the avatars. I'm not going to buy that because I'm still saving up my coins for future Black Legends and also white, white colors that I want to get. But there is an avatar that you can get, the one that I'm using, the Flaming Pumpkin. And then uh, we also can get the Haunting Colors for these four legends. These are the four legends that have been released since the last Halloween event. So, pretty cool. Let's go ahead and get Jay Yun. Ooh, actually I'm gonna use Mammoth Coins because I don't wanna use Gold Coins. The reason I use Mammoth Coins is because I can buy Mammoth Coins whenever I want, but the Gold Coins actually takes a lot of time uh, to get and effort. You can't just buy Gold Coins. And you need Gold Coins to get Black Colors or White Colors. As you can see, they're 10,000 each. So, you know, it costs a lot. I'd rather save the 3,000. All right, there we go. You can't buy these with Mammoth Coins. You have to use Gold Coins. All right, so let me show you what I was talking about with the podiums. There's actually more uh, Halloween podiums than what they showed there. So there's Graveyard Shift, right? Actually, let me go into, Online. let me go into like a lobby. Oops. Online. All right, so you can actually see the podium here. So we have Graveyard Shift. There was the Toil and Trouble. There was Spellbound Tree. I think this was also a Halloween one that I don't remember exactly. Uh, there was Graveyard Shift 2019, which you cannot get anymore. Um, is that it for Halloween? Yeah, I think that's it for Halloween. Literally, the Graveyard Shift 2020 is barely any different from Graveyard Shift 2019. You can see the difference right there. That's the 2019 I have equipped, and then 2020. Almost the same, but a little bit better looking, kind of. Alright, so in today's video, we are going to play every single Halloween skin that there is in the game, alright? We're going to start it out with the new ones, so let's go ahead and do Werewolf Thatch. Boom. Oh, I like the sound effect that they had there too, do you hear that? A little bit different. And then we'll do Corpse Bride Mirage. Apocalypse Mirage almost looks like a better Halloween skin. I'm kind of surprised they gave Mirage another skin. She has so many already, but hey, there you go. Alright, the Halloween sound actually works. It's the same for her. And then, uh, what do we got? We got, uh, Dusk Till Dawn. Let's go ahead and do that. We got Dusk. I got Blood Moon Volkov. That looks really good, too. Actually, I'm on the wrong person. Sorry, Volkov. You're not Dusk. My bad. Uh, Dusk Till Dawn. There we go. And, uh, why not do Haunting Colors, huh? I, I would do Default Colors, but you can't in Strike Out. I have to do Strike Out because I'm, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. It's gonna take too long otherwise. It'd be like a 45-minute video if I did a 1v1 with every skin. There's so many Halloween skins now in the game, so... But fear not, I'm going to try to uh, showcase every skin. So if it looks like I'm going to three stock or something, I'll just KO myself and move on to the next skin that way. So 
Alright, going against Zims. I got that burnout emote. It's so cool. I love it. Look at these blasters, though. Really, really nice looking blasters. Don't be floating above me. I'll be blasting you with those cannonballs, baby. Oops, I tried to do a side zig and it didn't work. He almost got me with that. Boom. All right, let's take a look at the sword. The sword actually looks really cool too with this color scheme. Alright, you know what? I'm probably gonna KO myself here if he doesn't kill me pretty soon. There we go. Because I want to get to the next skin. Alright, we got Corpse Bride Mirage. And if you guys remember, we also have a Corpse Bride for Hattori. So, if we get one more Corpse Bride skin, I guess we could do Corpse Bride Strike Out, right? Okay, that looked like it, like it would have hit him, but... Popped him right on the head. And there's the scythe. I'll use the scythe a little bit, but I want I don't want to kill him all the way because... Gotta use the other skins. Alright, I threw away the, the scythe. <laughs> By the way, guys, I hope you're all having a beautiful day. If you enjoyed the video, please drop a like. It really helps me out. This is, uh... I'm not gonna lie. This, this Halloween event is not bad. Alright, I'll kill myself now. No, I wanted to use my other skin. That's all right. We'll start it out with Just Kill Dawn next time. GG, dude. I don't know why I did that. All right, let's start it out with Dusk Till Dawn this time. This Halloween event isn't bad, but like, I feel like... And then we're going to go to Petra Reanimated. I feel like they could have added a little bit more on the skins, but this one's not too, too bad, you know. All right, now we got Skelazuri, it looks like. So I'm going to go ahead and find her. There we go. Skelazuri is one of my favorite... Uh, Halloween skins. Ooh, let's do Synthwave. That looks really cool. Let me know which uh, skin is your favorite for the Halloween skins because there's honestly so many and they're they're all really good. I know we're gonna get a lot of different answers on that question. Ah, it's Gamer Girl P. I fought this guy this morning. That's right. I was able to beat him this morning, but he was a good good fight. So we'll see how we do here. Yup, I remember from the last time I fought him, he, uh, he does not have the honor, man, he, or she, she doesn't, she don't wanna let me get a weapon at the start after I let her get a weapon. I guess if it is a girl, then it's okay, right? The triple! I keep thinking I'm still playing Mirage, you know what I mean? I thought he would go for that weapon, but... Boom! Alright. Let's check out this orb. The orb is actually pretty cool because it's got like a little wolf face or something. Alright. I'm gonna kill myself here so that we can get to the next skin. Oh yeah, Petra reanimated. I love this one. She literally got two face, but the, the white face is on the other side no matter which way you look, see? Isn't that weird? Okay, okay, he got impatient with me. I have not played Petra in a bit. This is gonna be fun. No! 
The cross down stick that hits both sides. Hold that, thank you. Bye bye. Right on his head. All right, we're not gonna lose with Skelazuri. We're we're definitely not gonna lose with Skelazuri, right? GG dude, GG. And just like that, we got the win. All right, let's keep going. Uh, I think we got a lot of skins to go through, so <laughs> there's so many. Uh, oh, this was one of my favorite guys. Werebat Ragnar, look at that. He's got the Batwing guitars, pretty cool looking axe too. I love that Ragnar skin. Then we have Immortal Caspian, right? Caspian Immortal. Where, where is he? There we go. Very nice. He's got really nice looking weapons too, actually. I don't mind these ones. And then we got Monster Nash. Where is he at? There he is. Ooh, I could do Skyforge with the with these guys? Alright, let's do Skyforge. I guess I have Skyforge for all three of these. Oh man. This Ragnar skin, man. I love Ragnar skins. And I actually really like Ragnar. I mained Ragnar for a little while back in like season three or something when he came out. I don't remember, but. It was a long time ago, but when he came out, I was like, man, he's so cool. He's a dragon. He's a little baby dragon dude. And uh, he's so good, too. He's got really good signatures. He has axe and guitars, two really good weapons. So, All right. He has honor. He's okay. Maybe, maybe not. He tried He tried to hit, hit me on there. That's all right. All right. I'm just gonna damage him up a little bit with the ax before I kill myself and go to the next legend because I just love playing Ragnar so much. All right, good enough. He's like, what? Oh, Immortal Caspian. Of course I have Buttercup, the little little sidekick there to help us out. Gotta remember Caspian's moves here real quick. Uh, I thought he would do a neutral sig for sure, and he... No, I thought he'd do a down sig. He not really using Lucy and sigs. So there's a side sig. Alright, let's do the guitars. Shoop! Shoop! I love that move, the down sig on Caspian guitars. Because once you get that sweet spot down of like where it hits, people get hit by it so much. Bopter on the head. Ooh, nice gravity cancel down sig. That was pretty clean. We're doing all right. We're doing all right. Oh, I got to kill myself. I forgot. Okay, well, this was Caspian. All right, now we're going to look at Monster Nash. Oh, this one is really good. Nash is a beast. Literally, kind of. Oh, GG. All right, we barely got to use Monster Nash, but we'll go ahead and start out the next game as Monster Nash because we barely got to use him. Hey, I got Katar's damage. Nice. Yeah, let's start it out with Monster Nash. We barely got to use him. Then we'll go Pumpkin Spice Yumiko. Probably my favorite one. Yumiko. And then, uh, ooh, Demon Kin Diana. That's a good one. So many good Halloween skins here. Oh, should we go all black? Why not? Team black. I could go team black on every single legend because I have every legend of black colors. Pretty crazy, but I don't do it all the time because there's just other... Good looking colors, you know, there just, just is, so. But I like using black, obviously. I would not have made it my quest to unlock every legend black colors if I didn't like it. All right, going against full focus, exist. 
We're gonna take out this uh, Artemis with Nash, right? And then we'll uh, switch to the next. I'll take that hit any day. Never mind, that hit kinda hurt. Never mind, I don't, no more hits. No more, all right, all right. I'm still alive. Oh, Artemis, Artemis. He's trying to get sneaky with that, that little neutral sig, you know? All right. Thank you. You did a fa you did me a favor. I don't have to kill myself. All right. Yumiko. Oh, this one's going to be good. Oh, Nyx! You getting smacked around with that tombstone, aren't you? All right, I'll use the bow a little bit with Yumiko because we didn't get to yet. Oh, zero to death with Yumiko's bow. GG, dude, GG. All right, that was Yumiko. We didn't get to use Demon Kin Diana at all, so we're gonna start it out right there. We're going Horseman Lucian next, right? He's right here. Dang, that's a nice looking skin. It also looks good in every color. And who we got? We got Bewitching Scarlet. All right, we're getting to the, that's the last, uh, that's the last one, guys. It's the last squad right here. Um, let's do, Charged OG looks pretty cool. This is the, this is it. If I can get through all three characters right here, then we will have gone through every Halloween character that is in the game. Not bad, man. Not bad. I thought it would take a little bit longer. All right, going against Odyssey, Lacuna versus Lacuna. What a way to end the video. Three, two, Definitely not going to have to kill myself with this guy. Not like this. I didn't even get to use Diana, you bully. All right, that's fine. We'll use Diana next game if I have to. There it is. When in doubt, with Lucian, spam Qatar down sig. It works. There it is. Oh, I did a side air, but his side stick connected first. This guy's so good. Hey man, we brought it back though, we did. Oh yeah, the double recovery, let's go.
Uh oh, that's game! GG, dude, GG. Look at that Gold Forge Lucian. I told you it looks good in every single color. Oh my goodness, that was great. All right, we barely got to play Diana though. I feel bad, so we're gonna do another game. Encore, just a experimental 1v1. This time we'll use Demon King Diana. And on this one, I will use Gold Forge as well, because apparently when you use Gold Forge, you win, right? If I get Odyssey again, that would be crazy because it's a different... We went from uh, Strikeout to 1v1. I'm not a duck. Stars equal easy gimp. Oh, uh, okay. Alright, last game, guys. Last game. Win or lose. Win or lose. Last game. Here we go. Probably shouldn't have done a side save. I love playing Diana, guys. Diana was also one of my mains. I know I've had many mains in the past, but... You played the game as long as I have, and you'll... You'll, you'll, <laughs> you'll about main everybody eventually, you know what I mean? Don't know why I did that. Wasn't a smart play. Don't dodge up! Not on Diana, buddy. Alright, let's try our blasters. Bad, bad, I'm bad. Don't ever, like, do what I just did there and try to hit with the down air so much that... Because Katars will just eat that up if you miss. Maybe I can get a whip kill with the blasters. Never mind, he got me. I want to get the last KO with the whip. You know, I it's just a it's just a challenge that we put on ourselves. Let's do it. He dodged up again. There it is. GG dude. And that was Diana. All right, we redeemed ourselves, right? Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. So much going on in Brahalla right now. I mean, we got The Walking Dead. We got the Brahalloween. We got the eSports coming up. I mean, there's so much going on. By the way, guys, the eSports for the viewership rewards does start this weekend. So just remember that. Anyways, please drop a like if you guys enjoyed this video. As always, I hope to see you in the next one. This is Lucian Sword. Take it easy, guys.